Hey guys, I'm Kelsey. I'm a professional food reviewer and today I'm going to be answering all your questions that you ask over on Instagram. Let's get to it. Before I get started answering all your questions, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and drop any more comments and questions about how I became a professional food reviewer, how I made this my full-time job, and I'll answer them below. Here we go. Okay, so all these questions came from over on Instagram. You guys asked a lot of good ones. Let's start off with, are you still a teacher? So no, I quit my teaching job at the end of last school year to pursue Trader Joe's food reviews, Costco food reviews, full time. Um, I am not affiliated with either company. I just love to review the products and let you guys know what's good, what's not good. And I feel so lucky that this is now my full time job. That leads me into how do you make money on the internet? A very valid question. Before I started this, I had no idea how bloggers, influencers made money. I feel like I am very in tune with this whole world, this whole new world now. And the ways that I make money are through brand deals. So what that means is I work with brands that I love. I promote their products to you all. Um, it's like advertising. It's just on a different platform than what you see on TV. I make money through my cookbook, tra Cooking Through Trader Joe's, and um, AdSense. So like views um, on Reels, views on TikTok, views on YouTube, things like that. Okay, and then so many questions about my cookbooks, Cooking Through Trader Joe's favorites and Cooking Through Trader Joe's. Not affiliated with the company, um, just helping you all use the products to make amazing recipes. You guys asked how I self-published. So I self-published through KDP, which is on Amazon. I think that should be a whole nother video, um, but I loved it. I'm actually a professional photographer and I've always loved cooking. So taking the pictures, designing the covers, um, creating the recipes, all that came very naturally to me, but I would love to make a video to kind of go more in depth on how to self-publish a book if you're interested in that. So let me know for sure. And both of these cookbooks are available on Amazon. I'll go ahead and link them in the caption below. Perfect Christmas gift, amazing stocking stuffer. Um, perfect for anyone who loves food or Trader Joe's in your life. So click the link and you can purchase these in time for Christmas. Okay. <laughs> so many questions about how much I spend on grocery shopping per week and do I eat all the food? Okay, so a weekly grocery shopping bill is around $150 to $200, um, a little bit more expensive during the holiday months because of all the holiday seasonal items. And then now that I started Costco food reviews, I shop there about every other week and that's also about $150. So we spend way more than the average couple. I'm aware of that. It is for my job, a lot of it is and a lot of the food I share with family. I'm very big on not wasting, so when we get those humongous meals from Costco, I'll cook up the chicken pot pie and then I'll drive it around to my grandparents, my parents, um, Jacob's parents, and share the food. How long have you and Jacob been together and do you all have kids? So, Jacob and I have been together for eight and a half years. No kids yet, but I joke all the time when we go to Costco that we are going to need kids soon to help out with all this food. Um, but we met at my graduation party from high school. A um, mutual friend invited him, and we've literally been together ever since. Okay, moving on to the next question. How did you get started with Trader Joe's food reviews, and how did you grow so quick? So if you don't follow over on Instagram, it's Trader Joe's Food Reviews. I also started Costco Food Reviews. And basically, I've always been so passionate and into social media. Um, back in the Tumblr days, I started a very popular blog for mental health awareness. Um, I've helped my local Orange Theory studio grow and gain members. I've always been so into social media, so I wanted to start something for myself. And when I was looking into what to start, I love Trader Joe's. I always got the same products every time. That was a problem for me, so I made it a goal to review every product in Trader Joe's to figure out what are the best products, what's super good, what are hidden gems, and help you guys kind of make the store more shoppable. So I started that, and the reason why I picked reviews is because that was a niche that was not filled two years ago. Still really isn't um, besides my page, but I wanted something that was unique 
and helpful. So that's kind of where I got started with that. Okay, the last question is super fun. How did Drew Barrymore find out about you? I honestly have no idea. Um, she followed very early on. She is like an OG follower and she shouted me out on her show about a year ago, which blew my mind. And then this year she shouted me out twice. So clearly we both share a love of Trader Joe's together. I think she is just the sweetest person ever. And I so respect that even though she is so large, she really does care about everyone, which is amazing. If you have any more questions about how I make money through this job or about my relationship or food in general, drop them below. I would love to do a second Q&A. This was super fun. Hit the subscribe button and follow me on Instagram.